Uh, let me ask you, because we now know that there is a corruption issue and there's an investigation officially in the, in the country of Ukraine as it relates to Joe Biden, who said you got six hours, you're not getting the billion unless you fire the prosecutor investigating my zero experience son, Hunter, being paid millions. After all you went through, and now that you see Ron Johnson in the Senate and you see Ukraine investigating this issue, uh, and then the other countries such as China that Peter Schweitz about, uh, writes about in great detail, that Hunter, again, no experience, making tons of money. Do It has to be a campaign issue. How do you plan to use it, or do you plan to use it? Well, to show you how crazy it is, uh, it's not a campaign issue for the Democrats. They don't want to bring it up. They were obviously told you can't bring that up. So even people that are against, uh, if you look at uh, Joe, they're against Joe. They don't want to bring that up. That was off bounds. I watch uh, certain reporters say that this is totally unsubstantiated, and we're sorry to even ask you a question. Anderson Cooper, then he asks a question at one of the debates, and it was so mild, and a ridiculous answer is given because there is no answer to it. Of course, it's corrupt. And... Uh, so he gives a really bad answer, and they go into the next question. Nobody says anything. The other, the other people that are running, trying to beat him, don't bring it up. That wouldn't happen with the Republicans, I can tell you. I'm not saying good, bad, or indifferent, but that certainly wouldn't happen with the Republicans. And, uh, you know, it's incredible. That will be a major issue in the campaign. I will bring that up all the time because I don't see any way out. I don't see any way out. For, th for them, I don't see how they can answer those questions. And maybe they can. I hope they can. I'd actually prefer it that they can, but I don't believe they'll be able to answer those questions. That was purely corrupt.